Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Awesome Man. Larry Seven here. It's not gonna be your typical type of video. If you've been up the pace with news and YouTube stuff, y'all, you know that something horrible happened yesterday. The YouTuber Etika was found dead by suicide. He was missing for a couple days, and he they found his belongings by a bridge, and they he jumped off said bridge, and you know. He made a video. I but he pro he made a video right before he did it saying he was sorry to everybody and what he's done. I really don't know what he's talking about. I know he's done some he's been he's been doing some crazy stuff in the past, but you know people got problems. Yeah. I wasn't a fan of, of Etika. No, you can't call me a hardcore fan, but I did I didn't hate him or nothing. I what every time I watched him, he had me laughing most. He had me laughing all the time in his videos. He's just he, he was a funny dude. I could see why people liked them. But and I'm just I'm you know it's it's sad. You know somebody I don't know I don't know what to say. If you just make sure to spend the most time you can with your family members and friends, because you you never know on their last day. Because tomorrow they couldn't they they might not be there. They might some might have happened. They they could be gone like that that fast but anyway that's not what i want to talk about right i want to talk about this scumbag youtuber you might have heard from him. J. his name's j station all right now on the same day etico was found dead uh, like i'm pretty sure four hours after they found this body he released a video j station's a fake youtuber right all his videos are 100 percent fake he did a scam back in the day where he faked getting robbed at the house at, not at the house at his own house and he just fakes it, and all these twelve, all these nine-year-olds and eight-year-olds that, that their mom, nah, never mind. I don't want to get, I don't get all, you know, mean here, but all those, all his fans for some reason believe him, and he does these videos called Ouija board videos. So every time a celebrity or a famous dude dies, he decides it's funny to, you know. Say, oh, I'm going to go on the Ouija board and try to contact said dead person. He did the same with Mac Miller. He did the same with XX Tentacion. And, it, like, YouTube, what are you doing? Stop this, dude. I'm, but, not even four hours. I, I don't know when it was uploaded. All I know is it was on the same day that Etika was found dead. And the title of said video was A Ouija Board Challenge Etika 3 at 3 a.m. And the thing is, too, he monetized it, which means he was getting paid to make said video of that. And I didn't watch the video. I, I couldn't, okay? I really, I couldn't believe J Station did something like that. But he was, I watched a little bit of it. He's like, oh, I'm not going to, everybody's asked me to do Etika Challenge. Nobody asked you to do an Etika Challenge, bro. Um, nobody watches you. Who watches you? Oh, you're, you're, it's so fake. I doubt the same day that Etika died, everybody's like, J Station, please do a Ouija board Etika. Like, dude, have some respect for the dead. Like, come on now. Like, what if... Imagine being a family member or a friend of Etika's, and, you know, you're searching up Google or YouTube to get some on the situation that you just heard, and you see J Station's, his dumbass face on the th thumbnail, a Ouija board Etika 3 a.m. challenge. Like, really, dude? Like, you know, and I, I looked at the video. It's got more dislikes than likes, which I'm happy. Good job, community. But, like, YouTube, take this dude down. Like, YouTube, when one of your executives or, like, one of your important people at YouTube die and he makes a Ouija board video, what are you going to do then? What are you going to do then? You still going to let him, you know, get money? You still going to let him watch... Cause like, it's stupid, and he, it's, he, I don't know what else, he probably makes up some bullshit story about how he's like, oh, uh, Eteka, not Eteka, what am I saying, sorry, I'm just mad right now, Etika was like, do this, I, I don't know, no, I'm gonna watch the video, and I'm gonna come back and update you on the situation, alright, I'll be right back, alright, so I just got done watching the video, and he's like, uh, um, it's, I'm not a bad person because other people just doing it for attention and they're not monetizing it with me. Bro, you monetized the video. I got an ad before I watched it. You, you, 
you're so stupid. And he's like, he's in his car too, and he's like, I gotta hide from the people that broke. Nobody broke into your house, bro. You're full. You're so full of shit. You, let me tell you the video of him breaking people breaking in his house. He proceeds. He just got done after calling the police on the crime scene, and he goes back into his house. There's no tape. There's no evidence tape, or there's no police still watching the area. Nobody asked him how it happened. The blood and the fake blood and the knife, the bloody knife, fake it's still every on the wall. On the wall, nobody like confiscated it. You can tell it's so fake, and it's it's so stupid that people fall for it. And he's like, you're just doing it for attention. Nobody's out here to go this. So he proceeds. <laughs> yeah, but people are saying they're sorry for him. Nobody's disrespecting Etika by trying to contact his soul on your little Luigi board, bro. It's so stupid. And I hate you for it. I honestly do. I'm never going to. If I ever meet you in real life, I'll spit in your face. I swear. Honestly, dude, I'll spit it in that fake red eye you got with the makeup. What, what, what'd your makeup artist do for that? Where's, oh, he's got a little black eye, too. Hmm. He's hiding out in his car, dude. Man, you make me sick. You honestly do. And, like, I'm not, like I said, it's the same day he died, too. While Pete, like, he, he, he gave it no time. He said, he was like, Etika died? I'll shoot, better get that paycheck. Like, dude, you, <laughs> you're you honestly the worst YouTuber. You know how Leafy was hated? You know how, like, Keemstar was hated for a while? You are worse than them combined, alright? They redeemed themselves, but you can't come back from this. You honestly can't. Look, his... I'm looking at the likes right now. He's got 11,000 likes, and he's got 163,000 dislikes. I'm, get If you will, if you will participate... In the community of getting this to be the most disliked video on YouTube, I would appreciate it. But I honestly, I honestly don't have much to say. You know, like why? Who just sees the somebody dies and then they're just like, oh, time to get get money. Like other people made videos, but they didn't were they weren't like, oh, um, let me talk to Etika real quick. And they prayed, or like, oh, and you. They said how they were sorry. They said how they sent their condolences to the family and his friends. But like, you, you're like, hold, let me fake contact Etika. So he says, oh, please, I, I don't know. I never, wa I watched a minute and forty four seconds. I couldn't watch any more of it. He probably asked Etika, will you please tell people, uh, subscribe and like. Oh, let me see, let me see his um his comment on YouTube. Comment on YouTube is pinned comment 10 hours ago. 10 hours ago. What was it? 10 hours ago. 10. That's how long the video was. Alright. I mean, not, that's how at least when he commented. And his his pinned comment. His pinned comment. Alright. It says. One like equal one prayer for Etika. And it says. what you Really? You're trying to get likes out of the comment too. No, out of all the YouTube videos I've seen, it's like, guys, um, please like the video for Etika. Like, nobody did that. Nobody monetized their video either. Nobody made any money talking about a dude that just killed himself. Because nobody would do that. I'm so, I don't, I hope. I hope he didn't do the same videos with Stan Lee and Steven Hillenburg. I really hope not, because if he did, then that makes you makes me hate hate you so much more, bro. But I I got nothing else to say. Have fun, J Station, living your fake life that nobody. Have fun. Make sure to get that makeup artist to update you on those little bruises that you're putting on, because it looks a little. It's looking a little. Look, look, I can see through it. I can see your 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 real skin. But yeah, guys. Um, that's all I gotta say. Um, Etika's family and friends, if you're watching this, I'm sorry, and I, I wish you the best. Um, Etika, if, if there is an afterlife, I wish you the best in there too, bro. Um, I got nothing else to say. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for Etika's family. And, yeah. Alright, guys. So, like I said, J Station, you're a piece of shit. And, yeah, guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. And yeah.